everybody. We're gonna make a couple things tonight. We're gonna make uh, turkey burgers, um, and we're gonna make a sweet balsamic um, side of tomatoes, so cherry tomatoes. A lot of this I've already prepped, so I'm basically going to put everything into a bowl and form my burgers. So to do that, I'm gonna take some onion, which already finely chopped that up. Uh, I'm gonna take a teaspoon of fresh garlic. Just drop that in there. Then you wanna add a little bit of salt, not too much. And a little bit of pepper. Uh, you can start to just mix it up, get it all in there. And once you feel like you have everything mixed in, you can just start to form your burgers. How big you want to make them, that's up to you. You know, if you want to have one great big colossal burger, go for it. You know, make it a competition if you want. I think I'm going to make three or four tonight. First one's pretty big. Now, the one thing I'm going to sprinkle on top of this, which I probably should have mixed it in, um, is a little bit of chili powder. You can just sprinkle a little bit on top. On each burger. Now you could just mix that into the bowl. Um, I probably should have done that. I just forgot. So who cares? It's a you're making a recipe. It's an experiment. Hopefully it turns out good. Um, if not, you change it up for the next time. So, but that's that's what we're doing tonight. Um, now, basically going to heat up a. Um, pan to a medium heat. It's already been uh, sprayed with olive oil. And okay, for the tomatoes, we're going to put a tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil. Tablespoon of uh, balsamic vinegar. Then a tablespoon of honey. So I'm using Mike's hot honey tonight. I don't know how that will be. It could be good, could not be good. I'm just gonna estimate about how much. Then I'm gonna add the tomatoes, which were already cut in half. And some pine nuts. Okay. And then just turn the uh, pan onto a medium heat. And just a little bit of salt, same thing here. And a little bit of pepper. And then we'll get that going. And at the same time, you can have your burgers. going on the stove. Now you could do those on the on the grill. You can put them in a George Foreman. It's up to you um, how you want to do them. I'm just I'm just going to pan put them on the pan today. Uh, and I, don't, I think I said this earlier. You could do this with regular uh, hamburger meat. To be honest, I would rather have done that, but the store was out of it. 
So we're doing turkey burgers tonight instead. Um, but you can you can use this same recipe with with regular beef burgers, turkey burgers, whatever you got. Now, especially with the tomatoes, you kind of want to stir those up a lot. You don't want them to get you know too uh, soft in there, and you're going to remove those a little bit early. So before everything's done, you're going to take the tomatoes out as best you can. Uh, and then let that sauce kind of keep going. And then you'll pour that additional sauce over top of the tomatoes once you have it on your plate. All right, when you're done your burger, you can put it on the plate with your tomato. Now, I'm going to top it tonight with some chopped spinach. A little bit of aged cheddar cheese. So this is your final product. 